Алиса, какая сейчас погода? В настоящий момент в Москве минус 22, ясно. Hi, wonderful people, this is Lisa. I'm Russian living in Russia. Welcome to my channel. Nope, I do not live in a wooden hut and I don't have a bear that wakes me up. Instead, I have an Alisa, Russian version of Alexa or Siri. Let's go to my kitchen and make some nice vodka. Sorry, nice coffee, of course. If you are the first time here, hope you will stay here for longer. Originally, I'm from Vladivostok in far east of Russia. I moved abroad at the age of 23 and came back to Russia in 2023 last year. Frankly, I'm not your typical Russian. On the other hand, I know English, so now I can share with you our Russian life. The most frequent question or opinion I've got when I lived in Asia was Are you cold? You don't supposed to be cold, you are Russian. With all respect to people and to human biology, thermoregulation of all humans is same no matter what country you are from. Our apartments are nice and warm during winter. I usually wear home pajamas and I want to open windows to get fresh air. This is holiday time in Russia. I had time to cook my favorite Russian food, blini. I will eat it for breakfast with honey and cottage cheese. This weather getting ready to go outside is more like astronauts getting ready for a spacewalk. Sweatshirt and sweater together, tights and trousers. My cosmic mission for today is that I need to take out the New Year's tree outside. I had to make it smaller so that it can fit through the door and shake off all of the needles. Winter is my least favorite season because winter clothes are very uncomfortable. I usually like to stay at home. But life in Russia never stops in the cold. People go to work and visit friends, cars often break down due to severe frost. They often sit in the parking lots for weeks. People dress very funny. Usually only the eyes and nose are visible, so you can never tell who is coming if you see him from the back. Do you know the rule of severe frost? Breathe through your nose and never leak cold pipes outside. This is usually taught to children in winter. Why breathe through your nose? Because breathing through the nose warms the air before entering the lungs. You can't leak metal because it can freeze tightly. Don't repeat it, please. I warned you. Okay, okay, let's play a housewife. After cleaning, I need to do another cleaning because tree is everywhere. Sadly, new year is gone. It is time to set up house for new chapter. I'm doing food delivery and packing. If I would be a retro Russian girl, I would have to milk a cow and bake bread in the Russian oven. 
Thanks, it is modern time. Harry Potter is my childhood favorite book and movie. I've got a present for New Year, this magical Hedwig Owl. Fun fact, it is not a Lego. It is fake Lego because we don't have original Lego in Russia anymore. We have it, but it would cost as a luxury toy few hundred bucks. I'm impressed with the result, it is so cute. I cannot believe I could have accomplished it. I'm not an engineer at all, but my owl can move her wings. It took me six hours to build and the result is so incredible. I need to add few details and give my Harry Potter a little magic wand. Russian holidays will last until January 8th. These are the longest holidays of the year. On the 9th, everyone will have to go to work. I'm sure that most of the people in Moscow did it quietly, doing their favorite things at home, because of the abnormal frost. I'm also getting ready for busy work. This is roughly what life in modern Russia looks like for us. Have you found anything unusual? You can share with me in the comments. If you are new here to this channel, please subscribe and watch other videos on my channel. There are a lot of interesting things about my life and about Russia. Thank you for supporting me with your donations. Thank you for watching until the end. And of course, I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye bye!